Yo, YouTube, what up, YouTube? It's time. It's cold outside. I think it's like maybe high 30s, low 40s today. I got my brother. Thank God he made it to the office today. Thank God, bro. Yo, I appreciate you, man. Hey, what's up, YouTube? I couldn't have made it without you today. Look at all these things we got here. Bro, we're going to be busy today, man. Somebody look like somebody got this cool Roblox gun. That's pretty cool. Dude. Yeah, we we'll love that. Uh huh. <laughs> my brother got the the um the coffee set up, bro. I appreciate you, bro. We gonna need ten cups today. Literally, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's about eight forty-five. We gonna have some fun today too. Don't you worry. It ain't gonna be all work. We're gonna find something fun to do today as well. But let's get started. So I got a uh, notification that from the actual like website saying it got delivered, and then I went back to my Fishbox Fishbox emails, and I saw on November first I did get a notification that said Fishbox package uh, for you. Okay, yeah, no problem. So uh, if you could send me the tracking number. The, to, you could text it directly to this number. I'll give a look, and uh, I apologize about that. Is it from UPS? Oh, yeah, or, yeah, yeah. Is it UPS or something else? Okay. So yes, yeah, it's UPS, and I have the number when you're ready. Does it end in 1066? Yes. Okay, yep. Sorry about that. I definitely found it. It was uh, it's sitting right in front of me, but I must not have included it when uh, your husband came in. So I apologize about that. No worries. Thank you so much. No problem. Enjoy the day. Good morning, Sergi. Hey, Sergi, what's up, man? It's Napoleon from Fishbox. How you doing today? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> Celebrity, celebrity phone call directly to my phone? I, I was saying the same thing, brother. <laughs> that um, I would be in Philly on Thursday, okay. I think. I'm not sure right now. Maybe Friday, actually. Yeah, let me talk to my business partner. I think we might be able to make it Friday afternoon, have some food in Philly. Oh, that'll be and, dope. You know, after we chat with you, maybe you want to come with us. Yeah, um, man. That'll be cool. Yeah. All right, cool. All right, so I got a package here from uh, actually a customer that has her own business that the business I really respect and she makes great products. So we're gonna open it up now for you. There's this company called Majestic Glow. It's a candle shop, and, and we got this. Oh, there's the brand name right there. Ooh, let's zoom in on it. And that's the flavor or the scent, vanilla eggnog. Let's smell this drum. Mmm. Now this smells like straight. November and December. Smell that, bro. Let me know what you think. Mmm, yeah. Mm-hmm. That oh, smells really good. Some Ooh. matches. It's about to be smelling great in here. Oh, so awful. I'll leave her Instagram so that you guys can check that out. Make sure you support her. She's a local business owner and also a Fish Boss customer. We're gonna light this up and get to work. Right, so UPS just delivered, and me and me and Francisco was a little scared. We weren't sure if he was gonna have 80 packages or less than that. They had only, was it 27, bro? Yeah, 27. 27 packages today. So uh, everything that in here, plus all the stuff we putting away over here, 27. So that's a super light day. So I'm not sure what's going on. Still in the eye of the storm, or they just didn't put everything in the truck, and then tomorrow's going to be crazy. But we'll put this stuff away, and we'll keep moving. You said we had eight packages. I just got in and counted seven, and we're missing one from Uniqlo. Hold on a second. Let me see what the one that just showed up. This is small. Okay, thanks so much. No problem. I'm pretty sure I counted out eight, but definitely take another look here just to be sure. Hey, I found it in the trunk, so you're good. Oh, thank God, thank God. Yo, yo, what up, Fishbox friends? How y'all doing today? It's Tuesday morning, it's the 15th. I was thinking this would be like a little bit bigger on my wrist, man. This joint look. It's kind of right. It's kind of right, bro. Right. I mean, because you never know until like yeah, you, you put it on. Put it on. Yep. Damn, man. Damn, bro. That last watch, that was my boy Chris. Another watch guy came through. He was in Philly for the day from DC. Came up and I got to see that watch that he'd been talking about first time in the flesh. That thing is crazy. Life of a legend, just a day in the life. Might slide on you, I ain't staying the night. I ain't pick cards, I'm just playing them right. Photo shoots. All right, y'all, so. It's been about, a, I don't like my hair getting this long. It's been about over a week before I shaved, before I even cut my hair. It'd be like that sometimes in the winter time. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this head while I'm waiting for customers. And, you know, I keep all my stuff at the fish box store because you never know when you need to get a quick haircut in. Hey, 
Hey, what's up, y'all? So I'm back. I'm back. Feeling more like myself now. It's about 3 o'clock. Still waiting on FedEx. Everybody else has pretty much been here. Got to do deliveries tonight, so we're getting ready for that. Hi. Um, I just want to see if I could call ahead for my packages. My husband's on his way over. All right, you got it. I'll start getting them together for you now. Yeah, you're the best. All right, sounds Thank good. You so much. No problem. I'll okay, see you in a little bit. Yeah. All right. Bye -bye. Hey, what's up, Fishbox friends? Good morning. Good morning. Uh, UPS just got here, and we put in away. Francisco, what they say? Forty-seven to forty-seven. Yeah. Forty-seven. So we got stuff in there. We got stuff over here. It's actually not too bad today. Damn! Look at that watch right there. Ooh. If it goes in your mouth, it likely could end up in quarantine. So please, please be careful about what you're shipping. Yeah, Thank you very much. Thank you so much. <laughs> no problem. Enjoy the day. You too. So it's about six twenty-six Wednesday. End of the day. Gonna end it right there. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey, what's up, y'all? Happy Thursday. Welcome back. Welcome back. Hope you guys enjoying the day so far. It's about 9.30. Already had two people come and pick up some packages today. Pretty light in here right now. And usually Thursdays are the least busiest day as far as the amount of packages that show up. So I'm expecting the same thing. Friendly reminder for y'all today. And every day. But uh, we're going to get to work. We're going to try to put away packages like a champion today. And let's see what type of stuff we can get into on this Thursday. Thank you for calling Fishbox. Hi. Already at 768 packages. It's only Thursday. We had 775 packages all of last week. So things are really starting to pick up. Let's see if we can hit a thousand this week. Hey, what's up, guys? What's up? As you can see, it is real kind of kind of Novemberish outside. I'm standing outside right now. I see Fishbox in the background. But I had to put up some new signage because Fishbox will be closed on Thanksgiving, Black Friday, and that Saturday after. However, I'll have to be in work that day. Not on Thanksgiving Day, but the day after Black Friday and Saturday, I will be in the office personally. Me, I'm not going to ask Jonathan and Francisco to come on those days, but I will be here on that day because so many packages come on those days that if I did what I did last year and the years before, which is take thanksgiving black friday and the day after off and close the store down that monday was literally the worst day of my fish box career there were so many packages and we got almost 30 to 40 percent more customers this year than we did last year hey what's up fish box friends good morning good morning happy friday it's friday today really excited about that hello yo brother good morning bro happy yo, fr happy friday man happy friday to you how you doing brother i'm good man i need your help um what what I what they are asking of you all um, is a top down image of one of your pieces of mail. It's nothing that they're going to open or anything like that. They just need it for design purposes. When it comes to the beta testing, it's what you'll see. If you could send me like maybe two or three of like pieces of mail for you, so I could just give it to the designer to put it in a mock up. Appreciate you, man. Yeah, no problem, man. Set a reminder for twelve fifteen p.m. to send PJ the top down images. Done. All right, I could definitely tell you it's not coming out today. Three hours of footage. Sheesh. All right, y'all. So UPS and Amazon, the big boy Amazon truck just pulled up. And when the big boy Amazon truck pulls up, there's only one or two things that's in there. One is like a bed frame or something crazy heavy like that. And two is a mattress. And look at this. If you got your own mailbox store, the last thing you want to see. <laughs> are these mattresses because they're rolled up really tightly and they're really dense which means they're really heavy and we got one two three four and five just chilling in the window right now Yeah, we got two for you. One came in today and another one came in two days ago. Yay. All right. I will I will be there probably around 4 or 5 p.m. You got it. We'll be here. Hey, what's up, Fishbox friends? We got some special guests that visited us today. We got Serge, Sergi and Drew from what's the name of the Fishbox store? Outside the Box Shipping. And where's that at? 
We're in Brooklyn, New York. And you guys also have another business that you guys offer, right? Yeah, we came here to talk about Box Hero, a pickup service for Box prepaid Hero. drop offs. You got it, man. So uh, they just came by and they're gonna, I'm giving them a quick tour of the business. I appreciate them coming out because you guys found us from the vlog, right? Yep, absolutely. The YouTube channel. Yep. Subscribe. Yep. From Brooklyn, New York. Brooklyn, New York came down to Philly to show love and we appreciate yep. it. Hey, what's up, guys? So Saturday, it's about. 9.45 and you wouldn't believe how crazy it was already. Somebody came in and picked up five mattresses. Those mattresses that are rolled up in those boxes that are like 100 pounds each. Somebody picked up five of those plus f five sets of bed frames for it. So that was pretty heavy. That was a lot and we got that cleared out but I'm a little tired right now. Also we had a pack and ship customer come through and another customer picked up seven packages. So in the first 45 minutes, it's been crazy. I'm gonna try to get these shoes for Nolan. 70 bucks for toddlers. Jeez. Let's get the size 9C. Continue. You're in line. We're checking availability and we'll let you know if we can complete your order. Damn. So we didn't get it. Sorry, Nolan. Any sneakerheads out there that got these Jordans in a toddler size for retail, let me know. Yeah, I appreciate okay. it. Enjoy the weekend. All right, you Enjoy. too. I'll see you next time. Okay. Look at this guy, Jonathan. Yo, I appreciate you helping out the customers and everything, bro. Yeah, of course. And always remember, you can put that jacket on, bro. You don't have to go out there with short sleeves on in the in November, bro. Yeah. <laughs> What's up with that contra, man? You want to try, try to play a couple rounds of that? Oh yeah, definitely. You finished editing? Uh, I'm almost done. I'm just I'm just finishing it up now, and then we can. I would say, give me five more minutes, and we can play. All right, man. So I just want to hit you guys with some numbers before we close out this week. So as you know from last video, 775 packages showed up last week. That was kind of a down week compared to some of the weeks before, which I figured it would be. But this week, you have 1,018 packages. So that is a 31% increase from last week. So I can honestly say that now. Holiday season has probably started. Of course, next weekend is Black Friday week and Cyber Monday and all that. So I'm sure you guys know at your mailbox store too that things are probably picking up by now. So yeah, time to get busy. On that note, I'll see you guys next week. Peace.